Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a home bargains haul. I love watching these videos and seeing what bargains people have got from like home bargains, Poundland, B&M bargains, Wilco's, all of these kind of things. So I went there today and picked up a few things so I thought I would do one for you today. But if you are new around here then hello my name is Sarah Jane. I make videos on all different lifestyle things from motherhood to homey things, cleaning videos, hauls, anything like that. So if that's the kind of thing that you like I would love for you to hit that subscribe button and stick around for a while and don't forget to also click that bell button because it will notify you of when I have new videos. So let's get stuck straight in. I'm just going to pick whatever's on top and go through um, and the first thing is actually this. So this I have in mind for my downstairs cupboard, like under the stairs cupboard, because I actually have in there at the moment a rail, but it's actually one of those pull-up bars, which Anthony used to use, <laughs> which we now use to just hang our coats on there. But it's just a, such a bad use of space. And I wanted to get one of these. And the reason why I like this one in particular is because these bits are really long so that the hangers are quite far down. Because when you open the door, there's actually a space, an unusual, unusable space of about that much. Um, so yeah, I had to make sure that whatever I had was long enough to go past that and this was perfect. I also liked the fact that it's like a creamy kind of colour because um, I hate, I don't like to see this on the other side and that's going to be on the visible side so I just thought it would blend a little bit more than silver and this was, oh, it's not got price on it but I think it was about £3.99, I'm not sure. I'll have to check. I'll leave it in the description box if I can um, find out how much it was. But I think it was about three ninety nine. It wasn't expensive at all. But that is for downstairs. I also picked up some more hangers. I love these hangers, the non-slip ones. I have them all in my wardrobe, but I did discover that I just needed a few more. So I picked up ten, and they were two ninety nine. I've actually just gone and got the receipt because I realised that there were no prices on the actual things. So the door hanger was $2.49 and then the uh, non-slip hangers were $2.99. I think $2.49 for that door hanger is really, really good. <laughs> I also picked up some deodorant. Now, I don't normally use this deodorant very often. If I, I usually use Mitchum, but they didn't sell it, but I just picked up some of this for uh, my swimming bag when I go swimming with Ella, so I don't have to worry about packing it. Um, but I really like this one. It's just not one that I use all the time. Sorry, this is just in a completely random order. <laughs> the next thing I got was this is a Flora and it's the pink grapefruit. Um, it's a limited edition one. I love the Flora. I tend to use the linen I think it's called Linen Fresh one, but the linen one. Um, and I smelt this one and I thought it smelt nice. It's limited edition, so if I do like it, then I will go back and get some more. The thing that I was slightly wary of is because it's grapefruit and it does smell nice when you smell it. I think sometimes with really fruity scents, it can smell a bit like cat's wee. Which is why I don't like lemon or anything like that because I just think it smells like cat's wee. Um, but yeah, this one, it smells nice in here. We'll see how it smells once I use it. And if I like it, what I'm going to do is dilute it with water and put it in my spray mop because I think that would smell really nice. And it's also a disinfectant. So it will keep my floors really, really nice and clean. I also picked up these, which I thought was so, so cool. Um, they had different styles, but I liked the flamingos. Um, and they are for your beach towels. So whenever you're on a sun lounge or anything like that, sometimes it just falls off and I get sick of like trying to tuck it in. So I picked up some of these. How much were these? These were 2 dollars um, they also had some flip-flop ones, which I might get for Anthony, but I'm not sure he would actually use them. <laughs> but I got some of these for hopefully our summer holiday. I also picked up some of these um, storage, they're called storage cases. They're just like plastic ones 
and I just thought these would be really good for putting things in that I'm not using like clothes or even um, Ella's clothes if I'm putting them in the loft. Uh, they were $2.49 so I thought they were pretty cheap. I usually get the Ikea ones which are a bit bigger but I just thought I'd try these out so $2.49 for two. I also picked up Ella some bibs. I thought these ones were really good because they have the capsule um, for if she drops things. I do tend to like the ones with the sleeves um, but I thought I would get some of these as well. They are waterproof bibs. They've got one with a princess, born to sparkle it says, and then hearts. And then the other one is an owl and then some butterflies. And these were £2.98 for two, so there's two pack, so £2.98 each. These next couple of things I picked up for my sister's baby shower, by the time this video goes out she will have had it and it's a secret so it doesn't matter, I'm going to show you these anyway. But I actually picked up some cake or cup, they're actually cupcake boxes you get three in each. I've just realised I've only picked up nine, I should have picked up more, but they were 89p each for the three um, and what I thought was if people want to take some cake home with them they can put them in these boxes and I just thought they were really nice, they're like a minty colour um, and then they've got a clear plastic bit at the top but I just thought that was a nice alternative to just whacking them in tin foil, but I think I'm gonna need to go back and get another one. I also picked up these fans, so these are larger paper fans. I'm a bit confused because on the hanger they said they were 89p, but the receipt says three at 3.99. I very much doubt one of these was 3.99, unless it means that three of them were 3.99. I don't know. But yeah, these for also for my sister's baby shower, just for a bit of decor. I've already, I've already got some but I just thought I'd pick up some larger ones and a few more just in case. I also got some crystal drawer knobs. I don't know if you've noticed but there is like no furniture in this room other than the bed at the moment because we've just had the carpets done and we're just waiting to get some new furniture. I know that I'm going to get the Hemnes range from Ikea but um, as with the other furniture that I had I'm going to switch out the handles for these crystal ones and I got three sets and they were $3.99 each. Ah, I've just noticed that the three at $3.99 was those doorknobs and the paper fans were actually 89p each. And then finally, I got this storage basket. I thought it was really good because it's really deep and this is going to go in the sideboard that I've got just got recently for the living room and I can put all of Ella's toys in there, put it in the sideboard, put it out the way and you won't be able to see them just to keep everything nice and tidy. These are really nice because they're kind of like the ones that you can get from Tesco which are a bit more expensive. I'm not quite sure of the name of them but it's like a woven look. Um, it's plastic and it was $1.99. I also picked up a couple of bottles of pop but they're a bit boring so I'm not going to show you those. It was Pepsi Max Cherry if you're interested but there we go that is what I got from Home Bargains. I hope you had a nice time just seeing what I got. If you like a good bargain then leave me a comment down below. Give this video a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to keep up to date with any of my latest videos but thank you so much for watching and I shall see you again next time. Bye!